So is this just a giant soundbar that doesn't do immersive audio or is it a high-end hi-fi speaker or is it both? Let's find out. Hello and welcome to another video on AV Forums. I'm Phil Hinton and for the last 20 years I've been the site editor. I'm also a fully qualified ISF, THX and PVA calibrator. In this video we're looking at a very niche product, the Canvas Hi-Fi speaker. If you enjoy our reviews and would like to see more then please like this video and consider subscribing to the channel. Plus if you think others might benefit from our in-depth reviews then why not consider sharing this video with your friends and peers via social media and forums. We really do appreciate your support. If you're looking for a soundbar that will play back every immersive audio format available in 7.2.4 then this is not the product for you and we'll see you in the next video. The Canvas Hi-Fi speaker is a very niche product that is just as much about interior design and aesthetics than it is about high quality sound. This is not a multi-channel system for dedicated home cinema use, but it will produce a wide and enveloping soundstage with stunning audio quality. It's also a very high-end music playback system designed to give you the feel of two hefty floor standards, but with a compact box that's 55 inches wide. Not only that, when used with a TV, it becomes part of the TV design, fitting flush underneath your screen and attaching to it using a custom Visa mount. The actual speaker is the same width as a 55 inch TV set and you fit a magnetic grill to the speaker unit in a variety of designs and finishes. Plus, if you have a 65, 75 or 77 inch screen TV, you use the same 55 inch wide speaker unit, but you attach a grill to perfectly match your TV size. The design of the canvas will be its unique selling point for many purchasers as it looks amazing in its intended role in a living space. It fits so neatly to your TV screen that it appears to be part of the TV's original design, creating an all-in-one look that is classy and contemporary. You can choose from a wide range of designer grills that fit the main 55 inch wide speaker unit using very powerful magnets so the finish is clean and flush. Canvas claims that the speaker unit is incredibly inert and features satin black painted MDF with an extensive canvas invented bridge brace structural bracing system which gives it the strength and rigidity to sound superb. The drivers are organised in similar mirror layouts at each side of the centre logo with a next generation paper cone based driver unit, a high precision stiff paper cone long extortion passive radiator and SB canvas designed die cast aluminium waveguide silk dome tweeters that integrate into the front grills for a zero diffraction design. The inclusion of one HDMI with EARC compatibility Toshlink optical port, analog connection, and as well as support for Apple AirPlay 2 Multiroom, Google Cast Multiroom, Rune, Tidal, Spotify Connect, and DLNA means that you'll never be short of any sources to use with this speaker. What the Canvas does is offer a solution for those who want to have exceptionally good stereo hi-fi sound but without the clatter of massive floor standing or stand mount speakers along with the cabling that goes with those and along with various separate component boxes for amplification sources and so on. It's also not a soundbar in the traditional sense as it offers a much larger and taller front elevation which allows for superior sound quality as a result. It's designed to fit on a wall as a speaker on its own and called the Solo or under your existing 55 inch or larger TV set and it looks like it was always designed to be within that space. It produces superb two channel audio with stunning amounts of clarity, detail and separation. The wide stereo sound stage created by the Back 3D DSP is truly exceptional and when set up correctly you could be mistaken for thinking you were listening to two very expensive floor standing speakers. The clarity and depth within tracks are superb with excellent vocals performance, especially female voices without any sense of sibilance or distortion. 
The track Birds by Dominique Filmi is presented perfectly on the canvas with a multi-layered vocal sounding weighty, deep and crisp against a heavy yet fast sounding double bass that's expansive and wide. The bass is also utterly musical without any boom or sluggish response found on some other competing systems. Obviously, we can't play that track through the speaker for you because of copyright on YouTube and plus you're listening to it on some other device so it's not going to sound the same as the canvas. But take my word for it, it sounds amazing. And it doesn't pretend that it's going to compete with a dedicated home cinema soundbar for immersive effects and boombastic chest slamming action and sci-fi thrills. Rather, it presents film sound mixes in a wide and expansive soundstage in front of you with exceptionally good clarity and detail. Listening to the opening of Blade Runner 2049, you immediately get that wide and expansive soundstage with the excellent deep and weighty bass tones that pressurise your listening position as you would expect. Dialogue is clean and central within the mix and when the fighting gets underway each punch lands with weight and authority and you're drawn into the film as you're supposed to be. Yes, the envelopment and immersion of the original Atmos track is missing as is the ultra low sub bass from the title sequence but as a high quality stereo replacement to a large multi-channel sound system the canvas gives a superb account of itself within its design and performance brief. There is no doubt that this is a niche product that will only really appeal to those downsizing from a larger system or those looking for a high quality stereo soundbar for music and TV while also looking for something aesthetically pleasing. You will also need to have some fairly deep pockets. I was mightily impressed with the performance on offer along with the excellent build quality and finish. It looks amazing, it sounds even better if what you're looking for is a high quality stereo sound with an expansive soundstage. If you're looking for multi-channel soundbar with Atmos support then this is not the product for you and some solutions out there sound nearly as good and are half the price so the choice as they say is yours. If you've enjoyed this video then please do like and subscribe and please also consider sharing this with your friends on social media if you found it useful. If you want to find out more about what the members of AV Forums think of this product haven't heard it then of course why not head over to AV Forums and check out the forums there. Thanks very much for watching and I'll see you in the next one. Goodbye.